everything is just perception. There is actually neither right or wrong. That is the tree of the knowledge of good and, good and evil or right and wrong. When you can understand and comprehend that everything is simply merely shifting perception, you can make life a lot easier for you. You don't have to judge it as right and wrong. Um, it just is. And we all have our unique perceptions and experiences which are neither right nor wrong. They're just experiences. And they are shaped through the lens in our psyche. But again, it's neither right nor wrong. It's just perception. And so if you can look at it neutrally, that perception is always changing, always evolving. And... Um, Absolve yourself from the judgment of having done right or wrong. You're simply evolving. And in the process of evolving, you have to be permitted to make mistakes. As they say, we learn from our mistakes. Mistakes teach us. But there is no condemnation in that sense you've done a grave thing, you know, that deserves punishment. I mean, yes, we can get into all of those individual deeds, whether they're right and wrong. Um, but boy, that gets you bogged down real quick, real quick with your nose to the ground and uh, makes the world close in on you quick as a pit of hell. It's all a matter of perception. Yes, things happen here that are meant to happen in this dual world um, to our consternation, but we're here to learn to rise above right or wrong. We're here to learn to rise above eating of the fruit of the tree of knowledge of good and evil, right and wrong, and to see it as perceptions that change. Everyone has a unique perception. And you don't know why a certain person sees things so differently from you. Their lens, their soul, is shaping that perception. And it's not wrong. To them, it's right. Right? So... This is something that we have to learn to ascend ourselves from the very basic level of perceiving. There's nothing right and wrong. All is as it is meant to be. Everything is perfect. Nature teaches me that too. The other day I was watching a spider Wrapping up a moth that got caught in her web. You know, as humans, we would say, oh, how evil of the spider. And I was about to rescue the little moth, but then I saw the spider hurrying down her little winch line, ready to capture her lunch. And I thought, yeah, the spider needs to eat too. But it looks cruel to stand by and watch as she pumps her venom into her victim and then wraps it up for lunch or later. That's nature. Nature doesn't know good and evil. Nature just is. Right? But as humans, we have trouble placing nature when we get hurt by other humans. It's also nature. Just not a very evolved nature for humans. But everything is as it is. It's all perception. <laughs>